This is the Primetime News at 9. We're just two days away from the Sooners and Cowboys kicking off the new season of college football. Well, for Sooner fans, of course, game day is full of traditions. So tonight, Fox 25's Phil Cross goes behind the scenes to show us the Sooners' loudest supporters. Phil. Guys, the pride of Oklahoma started before Oklahoma was even a state. Today, no game day would be complete without the sound and the excitement generated by hundreds of the best musicians in the state. It's football season, and it seems like everyone wants in the game. But this isn't football practice. No, this field is reserved for OU's other best of the best. Some people have said that. I mean, it's hard for me to be completely objective about that. I think the world of these kids. I almost would rather be here than, than on the football field uh, tackling people. Not just anyone can make it into the pride of Oklahoma. All right, guys, let's go performance posture. Because playing for OU... Go, guys! You're the most important person. Be the most important person. Is more than just playing a few notes. One, two, three, four, push, one. Before the sound come the steps one, two, three, that follow in the footsteps of all those who have helped drum up support for the Sooners. There's so much tradition in the Pride that it's just overwhelming, and it's amazing to be a part of that. And it's not as easy as it looks. Trust me. Each step has to be perfect. Point it even more. Not, not without a doctor. Like it's easy to get one person to do it, you know, mm -hmm. exactly. But to get 300 people doing it at the exact same time, the exact same way, that's the fun part. But when it all comes together, you won't find anyone who says the hard work wasn't worth it. As soon as around that field, everyone is just crazy and yelling, the stadium's shaking. And like I said, you, you never forget that. Everyone says you won't forget the first time you step out of that tunnel, and I can't wait for that. <laughs> you can't help but feel the excitement in the air. I'm excited. I'm so excited. I've waited all my life, pretty much. I've been trailing since I was three. So I've waited all my life to be able to have this opportunity to twirl for a huge college. Megan McGeary is the new featured twirler, and she's good. Got it. Got it. Let's go. Take the right hand off. Turn it over. I, however. Down. Uh, I ran out of stick. I'm not. Here to the left, and then to the right. There you go! Oh, man! But that's okay, because it's Megan's skills that will wow the crowd. Okay, so lift your left knee, you right. and feel your, your you left heel come up your okay. leg. Alright, so, so just like... <laughs> it takes years of practice to be part of the pride. I did it perfect, you weren't watching. <laughs> and even more hard work to entertain a crowd that's used to the very best. We have to earn that every single day throughout the season by doing a great job of supporting the Sooners and, and the very best job of being ambassadors for the university that we can. And I've learned it's fun to play around, but when it comes to being the best, well, I'd better leave that to the professionals. It's not just the first game the Pride has to prepare for throughout the season. They'll also choreograph and perform five or six different halftime shows. Andrew? That was good, Phil. Never had your peg as a marching band kind of guy. <laughs> well, the Pride of Oklahoma will perform at the first game of the season this Saturday. Then they go back to work at the home opener against Idaho State next Saturday. I think Phil's going to be recruited. He should be proud. He should be. 